Good morning, campers! Except the Jamie women. Because they all are. Seriously. Oh, yeah, we'll do it. So like I said, I know little to nothing about what's going on in this game. It's um... Shh, I'm figuring out right now. Are we recording? Oh yeah, we're live. Oh, we should probably introduce ourselves. Yeah, we got we got a few new extra. Well, hold on, there's an intro. <sighs> Good morning, Cam. Traces of the supernatural reveal themselves. It's super quiet so that it can pick up our voices. <laughs> but there's an actual guy reading this. Traces of the supernatural reveal themselves more often than intelligent and reasonable men would prefer them to. Chimeras, worshipped by our ancestors centuries ago, crawl back into the life from ancient times. The directors of our fate rain ash down on us from the gray heavens. They conceal themselves beneath us, above us, and among us. Stay hidden until we muster up the resolve to meet their malevolent gaze. Questions. Having been discovered, they appear in the flesh for a mere moment. And then they expire horribly, wreaking havoc on the world that they rightfully see as their toy. Question. Yes. Does Jesus know about this? Because he needs to know about this. <laughs> because he'd flip a shit. Just a little. See, I don't like to read, so I'm going to just, you know, judge well, this game well, there, poorly for that. Well, there, well, there, was, a, there was a narration, but, it's, but I lowered the volume. Oh my so. god, that demon is horrible. It actually moved. Oh god! Oh, yeah. these demons are scarier than I thought they would be. They're looking into your soul. Oh. Brown bear here. <laughs> so, yeah. So, we're here. So, it's TJ5. Welcome to the show. We're here with Jake and Sandy, as usual, but we are now also joined by... Uh... <laughs> is that a name or that something? That guy! That guy! Call yourself whatever. We're gonna call... We're, we're gonna call you Ryan at some point, regardless. Yeah, that works. Ryan. <laughs> and my lovely girlfriend? Jordan. Yep. Jordan. She'll be mine one day. <laughs> and this boys and girls <laughs> is Pathologic. He looks like a painful angle to your at. I can do that. Is this what they base <clears throat> the series of unfortunate events off of? Yeah. <laughs> well, you, have to, you have to wonder at a point, don't you? Oh, what? Oh shit! Oh shit! I should, I, I should have a stopwatch. Does anyone have a stopwatch app? Yep. Just, just do it. Whatever. Snap to the browser, like you're no, no, no! Just do it. <laughs> Whatever. It's browser done. Just He's, give Paul Palpatine and do it. <laughs> oh, Man, you keep forgetting there's that thing. <laughs> <laughs> the door will not shut. I will pull it. Now I'll do it. I'm gone. So you can shut yourself in. Get ready whenever. Yeah. You can go ahead and start start it now. Just let me know when it reaches this 10 minutes. This will be a opening. <laughs> you were always about that thing. Brown Bear just came out. Yeah. And <laughs> oh, yeah. I'm wondering how long before before your upstairs neighbors wonders about the the, the enraged Mexican slamming doors downstairs. Um, I don't know. Well, they're probably at high So, downstairs. let's see now. <laughs> so, so, some of y'all may need to be quiet for this first part. Well, actually, let me double check this. I don't think I can do that. I can't remember if this has subtitles or not. I don't think it does. Well, this is a shitty game, then. It may... <laughs> <laughs> How dare they? Um, it's it's a, it's possible it's a really old game, so... I can tell by the graphics. The horrible graphics. I, I mean, I can adjust the volume settings, but I also wanted to make sure that it can pick, up, pick us up. Okay. So... I'm just gonna lower the mute. Oh, that's the lowest the musical guy. Excuse me. The master volume? Don't lower the master Okay. Nah, that'll do for now. Okay, so this next part, it's talk all talking but no subtitles, so. So it's all about trickery. Wherever have you come from? No. No. But if we ourselves are to suffer deception, our hands are no longer tied. Where are we? <laughs> what are they saying? The master of the contractions there. Why do they walk so slow? And already inside. Is it and why are they like robots? Because the pretentiousness is holding them down. <laughs> <laughs> do you see my slow ass walking? So it's not real for now? 
so it's not. Really I fun. don't think it has started yet. I am a robot. It's definitely struggling. Was she waiting on the start? We need to perform a sectio transversalis. Cut the wall. There's no other way out. Cut the wall. What else is there to do? I know what to do. Yes. I with, I will talk with like on the one hand, it sounds like they're talking about surgical stuff, but at the same time, the rest of it is like total non, like existential nonsense. It's hard to tell what's going on. Yeah. Do you see me moving? Well, whatever it is, the religion has something to do with Elsa and the evil stepmother from uh, Cinderella. <laughs> Bye, guys. Um, Dark Shadows over here is a doctor. Um, Game of Thrones background character number two back there. I think he's like a surgeon or something. And I don't know what the fuck's going on with, um, with anime voice over here. I'm pretty sure that's oh, a robot Oh, you mean female disguise. gorilla singer? <laughs> oh, you mean noodle. <laughs> it's, that's female? I never knew that. Yeah, the Japanese girl that showed up in a FedEx box. The one in the skirt. She's in a skirt? It looks like a skirt. <laughs> I, I think her name is Changeling. Neither of you has compassion. I she will never be able to escape this world with that slow ass walking. She's in slow, but everyone else is in slow. No one else is moving. How can you tell? Because they're robots. Because <laughs> <laughs> they're voices. You know, I should warn you all that this game is incredibly confusing and it's only going to make less sense since you're all talking over the intro. It's not even a trap. It's a grave. It's not a... It's a grave. can't say I hold a soft spot for it. I can see that. What the hell are they saying? Stuffed or not, it's breathing. Stuffed or not, it's breathing. It can be healed. It can be healed. You mean the speaker's down here. Killer? But you will. Mark my word. That's exactly what will happen. But I can avoid it. No. We won't ever get along. I suggest we be on our way. Is, is this a play recital? <clears throat> I'm starting to get that vibe. The clock is ticking. The clock the is... Let's go then. The clock is ticking. The whole world is staged, Jake. The whole the whole stage has gone dark and they've frozen in place. What, you're just like an observer of like a fucked up play or something? Fucked up badly active play? <laughs> Ryan, the whole world's play. What the hell is this? Character selection. Oh. Bachelor. Haraspex. Changeling. So, young John Stamos, evil John Heater, or cancer-ridden Lady Gaga. <laughs> 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 I don't know, so, man. Those so, eyes are very piercing. Now, this guy, he starts out really strong. Like, the, the story arc opens with him getting jumped by a bunch of, like, sailor hoodlums at a train yard. So let's start with The Bachelor. The history of humanity witnessed a number of catastrophes that have demonstrated, without a shadow of a doubt, the pettiness of human achievement and the triumph of the invincible evil. <laughs> Outbreaks of infectious diseases that have from time to time wiped towns and cities off the map are undoubtedly among those, however smart and virtuous. The people caught up in these destructive events have repeatedly come to the conclusion that it's no, no use trying to fight these circumstances. The best you can do is bite the bullet and cope with your losses. This is the story of a person who has managed to work a miracle and defeat a seemingly unvanquishable foe. Oh. Well put. Have mercy. The invisible enemy. If he's invisible, I can't see him. Daniel Dankowski, a bachelor of medicine, that's mine, oh, shit. <laughs> wasn't there already a was brought here by something that is most unfortunate. I have argued theory challenging the existing notions of human mortality is being harshly persecuted by the powers that be. Suddenly, a letter arrives from a colleague suggesting that there is previously undiscovered evidence which may support Denkovsky's claim. I'd like your attorney to like 1940s reporter here. <laughs> there was a settlement, the letter says, ruled by an extraordinary man who may well have seen... Grasping at straws of hope, Denkovsky decides to follow what he believes to be a sign of divine providence. 
Without further ado, he I sets off to the settlement. Late at night, the bachelor That's arrives in town. Cold. As he seeks room and board, and he gets to know a girl a, a girl called Eva Eva Yan and stays at her place till dawn. Oh, I wonder what they're doing. So this is an evil Oregon trail. Oh god, is that Oh pancakes! Oh. <laughs> Do you see my bag? Who the fuck said that? That is a clock. That's a guy. Okay. A chair. Mm-hmm. <laughs> that is your hand. <laughs> that is his hand. <laughs> yeah. Is that uh, is that a smell in my hand? Do I look enough like Martin Sheen from uh from uh oh, I can't even remember the name? Uh, Mass Effect, yeah. <laughs> Elusive. The spider from Game of Thrones. Mmm. <laughs> mmm. Am I there inside? yet? Ah! Books! Literature! Manuscripts! <laughs> really? <laughs> Sleep deprived women! You see over here, this is a guy. <laughs> yes, I am a guy. Michael Bolton. <laughs> Oh god, he does kind of look like him. Yeah. <laughs> well, like the outfit, yeah. Hmm. Hmm. How am I reading when you're watching this? Yeah. Uh, yeah, that's place, you know? Yeah. I like the snake skin. I just said, I like the snake skin. Uh. What? Yeah. <laughs> appealing body, appealing body, butterface. Classic butterface. I think her face is made butter. <laughs> <laughs> There's the changeling girl again. She looks completely different. She actually looks like a human in that picture. <laughs> Maybe this game should have been like a cartoon game. She left Borderlands, went emo, and joined this game. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck you. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck you? <laughs> yeah. It's a perfect word. I think that's the surgeon. <laughs> he looks even cooler now, but not anymore. <clears throat> As of today, my mission remains obscure. The examination of Simon Kane, who is rumored to be a man of incredible longevity, may shake the very foundation of modern thanatology and challenge the, exist the ex existent notions of death itself. However, even, this even if this undying leviathan proves to be more than a fairy tale, the mere confirmation of his existence won't suffice to prevent the powers that be from shutting our laboratory down. You notice that he never refers to them as anything other than the powers that be. I need, to, I need to figure out the most fruitful approach. Simon is a well... Oh, we're approaching ten minutes. I'll just finish this up. I need to figure out the most fruitful for a respected man, and if he mistakes my interest for effrontery, it would be nigh impossible to convince him to help break mentality. That's ten minutes now. And I think... Okay, that was weird. Like, the black bars came down and they obscured the frame rate, so I'm thinking that that was recording properly and we're so back. in any case in any case we've reached the end of this allotment so we'll pick up from here next time bye bye